I've been testing all of Canva's newest video editing features and let me tell you, I have been impressed. With the rise of short form video in the past couple of years, I don't know about you, but I've been feeling increasing pressure to prioritize time in creating short form. But for someone who has been a fan of long form video for a really long time now, I actually find it quite tedious to be editing so many short clips into a super short 60 second video. Until I tried one of Canva's newest features, BeatSync, which claims to help you automatically and seamlessly sync your video to the beat of the music, which is exactly what it did for me. So I wanted to hop onto Canva to show you how you can use it as well. Hello, hello, I'm Cheryl here at Made on Sunday Studio. I talk all about branding, design, and creative entrepreneurship on this channel. So if you are creating or growing your creative business right now, then be sure to subscribe to follow along. Now, before we get into this tutorial, I do want to let you know that my newest Skillshare class is about to launch on August 28th, 2023. It is called Romanticize Your Business Video Content Creation with Canva. And it is for all of my service-based entrepreneurs, you know, designers, copywriters, coaches, whatever kind of service-based business you are. And you're hoping to finally hop into video creation um, as a form of marketing strategy for your business. Now I'm going to go through all of the basics with you from setting your goals for your video, you know, strategizing, letting you know how to set up your equipment, scripting, creating your shot list, to picking music, and finally we're going to be filming with just your iPhone and then editing with the Canva video editor. So if any of this sounds interesting to you and you want to start diving into video content creation as a business strategy, as a marketing strategy for your business, then be sure to sign up for the waitlist in the description below. If you're watching this after August 28th, I'll also leave the links to the class so you can sign up for a free trial to Skillshare for a month and basically take my class for free. All right, with that being said, let's hop into the tutorial. Okay, welcome to my laptop. We are on my Canva account right now and we are gonna test out this beat sync feature. So first off, I'm going to go to create a design and I'm going to pick um, maybe an Insta reel. That's what I'm gonna do because it's a video format. Okay, so I really want to um, like pick a song from Instagram, but for this tutorial, I'm not going to do that. Typically I would like record the video from Instagram side and then bring it into Canva and then edit it here. But for tuto today's tutorial, I'm just going to keep it simple and pick an audio that's already in Canva. So I'm going to go into elements and go to audio and just pick a song that has like a really good beat to it. Okay. It looks like this song has like a decent beat to it. So we're going to use it. Um, next we need to add in some, some video clips. So I'm going to go to my uploads and I'm going to bring in some video clips here. So I'm just going to bring in all these random short clips. So these clips are actually from my newest Skillshare class. So you might recognize them if you take the class. Okay. So these are just some examples. Okay. So really quickly, like for example, a footage like this, it's really, really long, right? So I'm not going to waste Canva's time. I'm going to actually bring it to where I want the clip to be approximately and kind of cut it down manually a little bit first. So for example, this one, I only want to show this part of the clip. Let's just watch it really quickly and see what it looks like um, without the beat sync. So I'm just going to play it. Okay, so clearly it's not synced to the beat right now. And also like, I think this is just the intro. So I really wanted to start where the song actually starts. Let's see. I think it starts around here. Let's see. So I really want, you know, these video clips to kind of sync with the beat, but clearly it is not right now. I can definitely do it like manually, but we want to try out beat sync in this video. So I'm going to click on the audio now and we are going to click on beat sync and turn it on. 
and it automatically, as you can see, kind of like shorten all of the footages to make it sync with the beat. And if you want to manually adjust it, you can also like see where the synchronization is. So these are the beat markers right here in white. So you can actually go ahead and let's say these clips are still too long. We can actually go ahead and edit it to sync with the next B. See how it kind of like wiggles that white part there. So if you wanted to keep it short, we can like sync it to this one or this one. We can sync it to this one and it makes it a lot easier to sync the footage with the music. So let's watch it really quickly again. All right, a lot better. Okay, now it's definitely syncing to the music a lot better. All right, perfect. So just with just one click of a button right here in Beat Sync, you can now sync up your music a lot easier. Now, keep in mind that these white markers right here is where the beat markers are. So if you want to manually just make these clips a little bit shorter, you can just go ahead and adjust it yourself by dragging it out and stopping where the white marker kind of wiggles and you know that is the NYX beat marker. All right, so that is how you use BeatSync super quickly with just one click of a button. You can automatically and seamlessly sync your footage to your music. All right, I hope you enjoyed exploring BeatSync with me in this video. And if you did, be sure to give it a like and subscribe to the channel for more videos like this. Now, before you go, I do wanna remind you to sign up for the waitlist for Romanticize Your Business video content creation with Canva. It is my newest Skillshare class coming out on August 28th of this year. It is for all my service-based business owners, whether you're a copywriter, a designer, a coach, or whatever kind of service-based business that you do. If you want to start using video content as a means of marketing strategy for your business, then this class is for you. I'm going to be going through all of the basics, my whole process from, you know, strategizing and setting your goals for your video, to setting up your equipment, to scripting, shot lists, how to pick music, and then how to film with just your iPhone and then video edit with the Canva video editor. All right, so if you are ready, then be sure to sign up for the wait list in the description below. If you're watching this video after August 28th, I'll also leave a link to sign up for Skillshare for basically free for a month, and then you can take the class completely free from there. All right, so I cannot wait to see you there, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye. <laughs>